It's tragic, really. Sarah is a gem, supremely talented, too. It all begins with the words. But it's also how you say them. So true. My performance brings Angela Cannon to life. Without Sarah's words, I'd just be an incredibly gorgeous woman named Mandy Bronson. She really understood Joseph Fox. My character, he's very complicated. Complicated? A five-year-old could write yeah, I'd be insulted if you actually knew anything about acting. Miss Bronson, what time did you leave the studio last night? We wrapped at six and I went straight home. I, um, drew a bath, poured a glass of wine, put on a little John Legend. Then I slipped out of my silk robe and let the bubbles soak every inch of my body. Dude. 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 Mr. Hastings, how about you? Ditto. You also drew a bubble bath and listened to some John Legend? No, I left right after we wrapped. And when did you last see Sarah? She came down to the set right before we shot a love scene. <laughs> More like a torture scene with me getting smothered by his bulk. Why don't you get your ass to the gym? I'll go to the gym if you pop a tic-tac next time we have to kiss. Can we get back to Sarah for just one more moment? 